Uh, I stumbled through general questions that I had spent two weeks preparing. What are Pitt's prospects for 1930 after winning the national championship in 1929? How does he like coaching a champion? What is the secret to being a successful coach? These are the kinds of stock questions uh, that, that he was uh, uh, asking. And he began to realize that he was getting the stock answers that, and that the coach constantly was looking at his watch. He was basically getting bored. I changed strategy. I said to him, you know, I've read those questions and answers elsewhere. Let me ask you about your coaching philosophy. A master of short answers, he responded, Pop Warner. Now, who's Pop Warner? He was the predecessor at the University of Pittsburgh as a coach and had set up basically the, the national championships that were at the University of Pittsburgh. And prior to being the coach at the University of Pittsburgh, he had coached at Carlisle Indian School, where his primary uh, player at that, at that place was Jim Thorpe. So there, there was a, that relationship. Uh, he goes on to explain, uh, now Jock Sutherland was from Scotland, and that he had played rugby. Uh, where, the op where the opposition tackled you more often than you tackled them. You lost. The idea in American football is similar. Have big blockers, a guy who is scared about being tackled and has the talent to avoid it, and a team that has the stamina to outlast the opposition. He went back and forth for almost two hours until his, one of his assistants interrupted us, Doc, you've got to get to the field. Dr. Sutherland excused himself, saying that this was the first interview in which he had learned something. I, spouted, I smiled at the compliment. Little did I know how my investment in learning Jock's approach to football would pay off. Years later, Jock acknowledged me publicly as an astute student of the game. High praise from one of the, the keenest strategists of the gridiron. At the time, I was a Canadian who two weeks earlier did not know what an American football was. Obtaining my subject's background before an interview with a life uh, lesson <coughs> from his experience. So basically, this was his first experience in, in being prepared for an interview.